Next I'm going to show you another way of candying buckwheat, minty buckwheat. This recipe uses erythritol. It's a light and fresh sugar-free way of adding texture, as well as a beautiful cool sweetness that perfectly complements the natural flavour of the mint that you'll be using. The final product also has a softer, more crumbly consistency than when coconut sugar is used. If you're lucky enough to have access to garden mint or peppermint, then that will be an especially nice addition to your creation. Otherwise, buy your mint, organic if possible. Mint is a classic herb that everyone knows. It's beloved amongst medical herbalists who utilise its anti-cancer and antibiotic properties and for the ways in which it supports the liver. It has cooling qualities and it's really beneficial for the digestion. Smelling peppermint oil can ease headaches and travel sickness and all mints are high in calcium and other minerals. So for a batch of 150 grams of buckwheat, you'll need eight grams, not counting the stalks, which is a good handful. These are the ingredients we'll be using. As well as the mint leaves, you'll need 150 grams of buckwheat, 75 grams of erythritol, and 10 to 15 drops of high quality peppermint essential oil. Soak your buckwheat for about an hour. And while you're waiting, Chop the mint leaves finely with a sharp knife like this. erythritol in a grinder and give it a whiz. It turns into a very fine powder so take your lid off carefully. After rinsing and draining the buckwheat add your erythritol, your chopped mint, 10 to 15 drops of peppermint essential oil. I'm using top quality organic food grade oil from NHR oils in the UK and stir well. Spread this out on your dehydrator tray. Because the erythritol has a different consistency to coconut sugar, you might well find that your mixture isn't very damp, in which case you could put it straight on the mesh and it will dry faster. I'm going to put it on the Teflex sheet and dry for 12 to 25 hours until completely dry. I didn't need to put it onto the mesh because it was already dry enough. Store in an airtight container and use in chocolate. <laughs>